Uh, why do you think uh, Harbour Law might appeal to British breeders? Uh, I, I think he's got a wonderful pedigree and for a top class Stein horse, a St Legend winner, he's got a lot of speed in his pedigree. His second down was by warning, so we've been specifically buying mares to reinforce the uh, warning strain and it actually wouldn't surprise me at all if he got six, seven furlong two year olds, especially with the mares that are doubling up on warning. So that's going to be a really interesting aspect of his pedigree. He's got Chris in his pedigree, so again that lends itself to doubling up on Chris or perhaps his full brother Diasis. And, and I just think that he's got a, a sort of pedigree that is going to suit a lot of mares. And I think because of the um, support that he's receiving from his owners, Nick and Jackie Cornwell especially, they really are supporting the horse uh, to a great degree. I think he's going to have uh, a great chance of producing stakes horses. And uh, having looked through the uh, National Hunt um, stallion book as well, there were probably at least 50 stallion broodmare sires uh, in the National Hunt sphere that um, I picked out for him. So, you know, it, it's, it's almost a question of which mares are not going to suit him rather than ones of which are. So I think he's going to suit a lot of mares and do really, really well. And I'm very excited by his future. And I genuinely see him as having the genetic potential to become the leading uh, dual purpose stallion in Europe. Um, obviously it's a, a long term game with regards to the national hunt side of things, but uh, he's, a, he's a lovely individual and uh, I think he's going to do really, really well.